This disease is not diabetes, right? It is not heart disease. We aren't talking about 32,000 patient trials, which means that we as a community have got to behave as one. That continues to be a desperate need. And I will ring the battle cry that the fact that we have two drugs should be an even greater argument that we need to continue the work in both clinical trials and clinical drug development. Mm -hmm. And to do that, we have to behave as a group working with industry, with the NIH, with the European community, and the practitioners at large to ensure that these patients all contribute scientifically in one way or another so that the next generation is facing a much better set of outcomes than where totally. we are at totally. today. I think that given what we've seen uh, over the course of the last several years, what we saw at the ATS this last year, uh, which we've been discussing, it really is the optimal time at this point to really be able to develop a global approach that allows us to try to capture and synthesize all this information so that we can further refine what we're doing therapeutically now, and we have good agents now, and in the future develop additional combinations that are really going to continue to extend the major beneficial impacts that we've now seen over the course of these last two years. I couldn't agree more.